Hello, today I will be talking about movie review number 839. This is Pho. Pho is a 2023 film that is directed by Garth Davis. This is from Amazon MGM Studios, Anonymous Content Films, and I Am That Productions that I saw on October 21st, 2023 at Esquire Video in Clifton, Ohio. It's very interesting that I'm calling it Amazon MGM Studios because of the merger between Amazon and MGM this year. Right, the logo is Metrical and Mayo Pictures, but it has the an Amazon company byline under the bottom but it's still referring it to as Amazon MGM Studios. Pretty interesting. But anyway, um, Phil. This is a new movie that stars Sorcery Ronan from Little Women and Lady Bird and Paul Mescal. So Sorcery Ronan plays Henrietta, or Hen, Henrietta. Paul Mastor plays Junior, who is Henrietta's husband. Now, Flo is based on the 2018 novel of the same name. And so, this movie is about a married couple, Hen and Junior, who form a secluded piece of land that has been in Junior's family for generations after generation. Now, this takes place in the future, where there's more advanced technologies, and AI, more artificial intelligence, and world traces. And so, Hen and Junior just want to have a quiet, normal family life. It's only just the two of them. And they are happy where they are. They want to live there forever. But then, their quiet life is thrown into turmoil when an uninvited stranger shown up at their door with a startling proposal. Uh oh. So Aaron Peel plays Terrence. He comes to the house, to the farm, where Henrietta and Junior live, and he has the proposal. He informs Junior that he will be sent to a large space station. For a, few, for a few years, and that his wife will be left in the company of a robot. A robot that will be exactly like Junior. It will show his exact physical characteristics, features, but Henry and Junior really dislike the idea, especially Junior. He's like, no way. No way, I'm not having a robot with my wife. And Henrietta is also trying to figure out what to do with the situation, as Terrence is making it more and more complicated to the point where if Junior doesn't go, there will be consequences. Right, this proposal suddenly turns into an order, an order by the government saying that Juno must do this, or there will be consequences. And Juno and Henrietta are just trying to figure out how to proceed with this. And the movie takes place a year later when the stranger actually moves in the house, just before Juno takes off. Because they have to make preparations on Juno's robot. But Juno is trying to figure out how to get out of this. But well, Henrietta is also trying to figure out what will happen if her husband does go. What will happen to her and her wife. I really won't say this due to spoilers, but you won't believe what happens. Because I thought Okay, this is basically based on a based on a decision that would definitely impact both Henrietta's and Juno's lives forever. But then something happens towards the second half of the movie that I'm like, whoa. 
did not see that coming. Obviously, I won't say to you spoilers, but it's definitely a pretty good movie. It definitely will show you the emotions that Junior and Henrietta has about this situation, and also with the fact that Warbot will live with Henrietta when Junior is gone. Oh yeah, it's definitely a good movie. I definitely recommend it. So that's my movie review. Flo, please stay tuned for this movie review. Alright, goodbye.